Hi, my name is Ruth Cocina. I'm the CEO at Mycolab and today we're going to show you a little bit how to do a correct soil sampling. So the first thing you have to do is to divide the area in uh, homogeneous soil types. I mean, if you have different soil types, we need you to, uh, to separate them and do sampling for every single one or the results will be a mix. So for example, if you have different crops or you see different colors in the soil, then you have to, uh, to, to sample them individually or you have fertilized differently, whatever you have. Okay, once uh, you have the area selected, what you would do is that you would do a, a sampling in the homogeneous area using a zigzag pattern, taking samples, a minimum of five samples per hectare and a maximum of two hectares per homogeneous area. Okay, that's me. Hello. We need you also to label the bag uh, correctly with your name and very, very important, the, the plot name or the plot area, something that will help you to identify it correctly later. Then you will dig a hole of 25 centimeters depth. We'll take the first five centimeters at the edge of the hole that you made and then you will dig you know, and, and pick up the soil uh, following the wall to make sure you get the same amount of soil from top, middle and bottom. Of course, the bottom of the, of the hole has to be emptied of, of soil before you do that. So the soil that you pick is exactly the one from the wall that you took just like a, a thin layer of that wall. Then you will repeat the process uh, for the rest of the, of the area and you will mix all the samples together. If you have a probe or an auger, I, I like the Edelman type, uh, then you will just take off the, fries, uh, the five first centimeters and, and just uh, dig in with it. It's a lot easier, but of course you have to have it. Once it gets out, you will see that you get uh, more soil on the sides normally, so you will just remove that in order to have the same amount of soil from the whole uh, soil profile that you are sampling. And again, you will mix all the samples of the homogeneous area together. Remember, it cannot be more than two hectares and you need at least five points per hectare to be mixed. Once the sample arrives at the lab, then we will homogenize it. Don't worry about it. We'll take care of that. If you have taken off uh, the bigger stones and like little pieces of grass like there and stuff, better. If not, don't worry because when we homogenize it and, and sieve it at the, at the chemical, for the chemical analysis, uh, they go off. So don't, don't be too, you have to be very fussy about that. Then you, we will do some previous tests and if the tests are correct, we will take about one kilo of the sample and send it to the, to the lab for the specific chemical analysis. And if we don't like the results of the previous tests we do, we'll contact you and, tell, and discuss with you if we continue with it or we just uh, try to find another place. We will also keep about a kilo for future reference. So we always ask you to please send at least two kilos of soil per sample. So we have enough for the chemical analysis, enough for the previous test, and enough to keep uh, a sample at the lab in case we need to reanalyze anything later. And that's it. Remember to label everything correctly, please, so then we can be able to understand to which plot the results belong to. And in case you have any doubts, just get in touch with us and we'll try to, to solve it. And have a very good day.